Yo, what is going on, everybody? It is your boy Burst CG back here, and today we are once again talking about this game, Dragon Ball The Breakers. Now, I know I made a video not that long ago talking about, hey, somebody said that this game will potentially have open beta dropping on X date. That didn't happen. It's unfortunate. We all were, were super bummed, all right? I was alerted by a good friend, Ethan the Human. Um, he gave me this link to this site. It's, it's an unofficial blog but they still report on everything that's official. So it's just another news source. Um, and everything that we've seen here for the most part is, is everything official that's already been talked about. What I didn't notice and what was alerted to me is that apparently that in this booth for the Dragon Ball stuff, uh, they will be having a Dragon Ball the Breakers photo spot. Now, let me, let me ask you, and you tell me down in the comments below, how dumb do you think it would be for them to have a, the Breakers photo spot? despite not talking about their own game for the last seven months. Right? Right? Now, you go to San Diego Comic-Con, people are going to expect you to say something, especially if you've got a Breakers photo spot there. Like, someone's going to walk up there and be like, you know, I haven't heard anything about this game. Is it out? Is there a beta that I can play or a demo or something? No, there's nothing. Nothing. Just imagine that, right? I, I would have to imagine that if... if it's now or never. We're getting closer to the end of the year already. It's it's July. Before you know it, bam, August is here. Before you know it, bam, September is here. And before you know it, October is here. The perfect time for this game to kind of really roll around would be in October. October to December. That That's just where I would see this game fitting more seasonally. Um, but I, it would blow my mind. It would absolutely blow my mind. If somehow this game just doesn't get any promotion, doesn't get talked about for more than seven to eight months, that that would be crazy. That closed beta I've heard was not that bad. There were some definitely some kinks that needed to be worked out, some balancing. But from what I heard, most people actually had some fun with it. So the fact that it hasn't reopened up for any betas in, in the last six, seven months, absolutely crazy. But... Anime Expo, that was that was a fail. San Diego Comic Con, Bandai, please don't, don't, don't cuck the fans. There's there's people out there who genuinely want to see this game make it. We we know that there's a little bit of some collaboration that will happen with Xenoverse. There's some assets already been leaked a long time ago. Just please, a, a new trailer, something, an update, anything besides just a photo spot please because you're going to piss off a lot of people if this game gets no communication after this event one of the biggest events in the year i i, I there's nothing else i can say you guys let me know down below are you do you guys honestly believe that they will go on San Diego comic con have a booth have a photo spot dedicated to the game but nothing about the game that, that just, it would seem wild. You guys let me know. I know I might be coming off really aggressive with this, but it's like, it, it, it's been so long that it's just blo it's boggling my mind just talking about it. That I we can go this long without having any information. And it's a Dragon Ball game. That's the thing. You know, you would think that they would try to keep you in the know a little bit about it since it's new. But hey, they, they like to report late on a lot of stuff when it comes to Dragon Ball games anyways, I guess. We barely, we got the announcement for Xenoverse 2, like, oh, release date? Oh, there you go, really late. How fun, it's in like a week or two. Um, fucking Kakarot, they just wait. They don't say anything until it's absolutely just ready to go. And if that's the way they want to go, okay. You guys got to find a way to do that in less than seven months because it just doesn't work for anybody at all. But anyways, I'm going to leave it off there before I go on a whole tirade about this. SDCC is soon. As you can see, there's a countdown there for days, hours, minutes, seconds. That's when it'll be. There's been a lot of exclusives and stuff revealed already for SH Figure Arts. I kind of talked about that hours ago if you want, want to go watch that video. Oh, man. I, I, I'm I praying right now that this is the moment. I will be following this very closely, seeing what happens with this booth. I, they said that there was going to be live streams, I believe. So, hopefully... But anyways, I will catch you guys in another video or another day. Catch you later. Peace.